Check out the performance boost I got after applying these Windows registry tweaks. Today's video, I'll guide you step by step on how to apply these settings to maximize FPS and overall performance, whether you're on a low end or high end PC. Get ready to unlock your system's full potential and take your gaming experience to the next level. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you never miss future updates. Now, let's dive in. What's directed with the lag and harping while you play games? So that you need a gear boost. So, this is the ultimate tool to lower your ping, boost stability, and give you zero lag. Pro players like Asian Jeff and Polarive to use it to stay ahead. So why not you? Download Gear Booster now from the link in the description and dominate every match. If you'd rather skip the manual tweaking process, you can save time by downloading my registry tweaks pack from my official website. It's completely safe. Feel free to scan it with any antivirus tool for peace of mind. After downloading, open the folder and head to the registry section. Simply double click each file to instantly apply the optimized settings. The best part? If you ever need to restore any changes, just go to the revert folder and run the corresponding files to bring everything back to Windows default. I've also included a handy text file with all the essential commands, making it easy to copy and paste them directly into the registry editor. This way, you can quickly jump to the exact location needed for the tweaks. Go ahead, grab the pack now and streamline the whole process. All right, the first registry tweak we'll be adjusting is disabling power throttling. Windows automatically limits CPU power in certain situations to save energy. While this is more relevant for laptops, it can also affect desktop users depending on power settings. This can be problematic for gaming because it not only impacts CPU performance, but also affects the GPU. If your GPU ends up running faster than your CPU, it can cause a bottleneck, negatively affecting overall performance. To prevent this, you can disable power throttling directly through the registry. Here's how. Copy the first path, paste it into the registry editor, and press enter. Now inside the power throttling key, look for an entry named power throttling off in the right panel. Open it and set its value to one. If you don't see this entry, create a new dwoward, 32-bit value under power throttling, name it power throttling off, and set its value to one. That's it. With this tweak applied, your CPU will no longer be restricted by power throttling. Next, turn off network throttling windows has a built-in mechanism that throttles network performance in certain situations, mainly affecting non-media content. However, depending on your internet speed and usage, this can interfere with gaming, causing high ping and lag spikes. To ensure a smooth experience, it's best to disable this feature. Here's how. Copy the next path, paste it into the registry editor, and press enter. Now, locate network throttling index and double-click on it. Set its value to 8 time f if you experience any issues with background processes consuming too much network bandwidth after this tweak, you can always revert it by changing the value back to 10. This will help ensure your network connection isn't unnecessarily throttled while gaming. Now, optimize TCP for gaming. The Transmission Control Protocol, TCP, is responsible for managing how data is sent and received over the network. By optimizing TCP settings, you can improve bandwidth efficiency, lower latency, and stabilize your internet connection leading to a smoother gaming experience. Here's how to tweak it. Copy the next path, paste it into the registry editor, and press enter. In the right panel, you'll see multiple entries that can be adjusted for better TCP performance. First, double-click on default TTL and set the value to 64. 64, then click OK, then find the global max TCP window size. Double-click on it and set the value to 65535 and hit OK. Now scroll down and find TCP1323 Ops, double click on it, and set the value to 1, then click OK to save. Now double click on TCP Max Dupacks, double click on it and set its value to 2, then hit OK. Now double click on TCP Timed Wait Delay, set it to decimal, and set its value to 30, then click OK. With these adjustments, your TCP settings will be optimized to reduce lag, improve packet delivery, and enhance network stability for gaming. Next. Disable CPU core parking windows automatically turns off some CPU cores when the system is under low load to save power and reduce heat. While this feature helps with energy efficiency, it can also introduce slight delays in performance, which isn't ideal for gaming. Disabling CPU core parking ensures your processor runs at full capacity for the best gaming experience. Here's how to disable it. Copy the next path, paste it into the registry editor, and press enter. In the right panel, locate attributes and double-click on it. Change its value to zero, then click OK. 
By making this change, all CPU cores will remain active, eliminating any latency caused by core parking. Now, prioritize games. In the registry, you can tell Windows to prioritize games when allocating CPU and GPU resources. This will not only ensure stable performance with minimum stutters, but could also improve overall game performance if other processes were affecting it. Copy the next path and paste it here, then hit Enter and Now. Start by finding Affinity and change the value data to F. Set the base to hexadecimal and hit OK. Next, go to Background Only and set it to False, then hit OK. Find GPU Priority and change the value data to E. Set the base to hexadecimal and click OK. For Priority, change the value data to 6 and click OK. Next, go to Scheduling Category, modify it, and set the value to High. For SFIO Priority, set it to High and click OK. By making this adjustment, your system will focus more on running games efficiently, minimizing performance drops caused by background tasks. Now, decrease maximum pre-rendered frames. If your CPU is powerful enough to handle gaming smoothly, lowering the maximum pre-rendered frames can help reduce input latency and make your gameplay feel more responsive. This tweak limits how many frames the CPU prepares in advance before sending them to the GPU. Here's how to do it. Copy the next path, paste it into the registry editor, and press Enter. Look for the max pre-rendered frames entry in the right panel. Double-click on it and set its value to 1, which means only one frame will be pre-rendered at a time. Click OK to save the changes. With this setting applied, you'll notice quicker response times, especially in fast-paced games. Next, increase system responsiveness. Windows reserves a portion of your CPU power, usually 20, for background tasks, which can impact gaming performance. By adjusting this setting, you can prioritize foreground applications like games, ensuring better responsiveness and smoother gameplay. Here's how to do it. Copy the next path, paste it into the registry editor, and press Enter. Locate system responsiveness in the right panel. Double-click on it, select decimal, and change its value to 10. Click OK to save the changes. By reducing the reserved CPU percentage, more processing power is allocated to your game, improving system responsiveness and reducing stutters. Now, disable fast startup. Fast startup may make your Windows PC load faster, but it also prevents it from fully shutting down. During a shutdown, the feature logs out every user, closes all the programs, and puts the rest of the system in a hibernation state before finally turning off the computer. Copy the next path and paste it here, then hit Enter and Now. Find the Hyperboot enabled, double-click the Hyperboot enabled entry, change value data to 1 and click OK. Now, increase the CPU priority of a game. While there are multiple ways to manage CPU usage, tweaking the Win32 priority, separation registry key allows for more precise control over CPU priority and latency. By adjusting this setting, you can ensure that games receive higher processing priority, leading to lower latency and improved performance when they are in focus. Here's how to do it. Copy the next path, paste it into the registry editor, press Enter. Find Win32 priority, separation in the right panel, Double-click on it and set its value data to 26. Click OK to save the changes. With this tweak, Windows will allocate higher priority and faster processing power to your game while it's running, improving responsiveness and overall performance. Finally, prioritize game traffic. By default, Windows reserves a portion of your network bandwidth for system-related activities. This means that when bandwidth is limited, Windows may prioritize its own processes over your games, potentially leading to higher ping and lag spikes. To prevent this, you can adjust the settings to ensure that your games always get the highest priority. Here's how to do it. Copy the next path, paste it into the registry editor, and press Enter. Look for non-best effort limit in the right panel. Double-click on it and change the value data to zero. Click OK to apply the change. This tweak ensures that Windows no longer reserves bandwidth for background tasks, allowing your game traffic to take full advantage of your internet connection for a smoother online experience. That's a wrap up guys. If this video helped you improve your gaming performance, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe to the channel for more optimization tips. If you have any questions or need further assistance, feel free to leave a comment below. I'll be happy to help. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.